But yet 98% of all what we deal with is spirit has nothing to do with any religion. Religion is only a political instrument. And it's like Edgar Casey said, no, Rudolf Steiner. Religions come about when the major mystery systems break down and come into decline. Then they put the religions out there, which is an inspirational <laughs> overflow of moralism. Has nothing to do with real spirit. So when I tell you to mix up some liquor and gin, and this is highly spiritual, you look at me like I'm crazy. You see, I ain't telling you get some Welsh's grapefruit juice and eat some goddamn vanilla wafer. Now I've been I've been relentlessly studying this information for the last 15 years. This shit get longer. <laughs> it <don't get> <laughs> but about 15 years. 15 years. It'll be about that much time. And I tell you, I didn't really even get into the zone until about 10 years into it. That's how much information. So damn, you can't come with some nigga riding some car with some little old book this big, some little Bible that they hand out in fucking fifth grade. Big old 40 year old nigga, a 50 year old nigga with a little Bible they give you in the fifth grade. And you gonna think you're gonna know some shit. And the Quran is even worse. They just tell you, look, don't even look the wrong goddamn way. All I gonna kill you. See what I'm saying? Now, we're gonna get that way. Then when the spirit roll this way, that's how you got to go. <laughs> now, but what I'm trying to say here is it is time for us to give up everything that we may think is spiritual and study the spirit. But too often, and for the last Umpteen years, anytime a person starts to study the spirit, they call that Satanism. So nobody don't want to go see Harry Potter because half the people are Christian, talking about they worshiping the devil. You see what I'm saying? And that was a movie to teach white children on what the fuck they need to be into the new eon. You know what I'm saying? And here we are, big grown rusty ass niggas up here um, singing some fucking songs in church. And people don't even know. They talk about, oh, I don't own a blues album in my house. God damn it, motherfucker. You know, history is a mother. If you don't know history, you fuck. Anybody know the history of gospel started from blues? Damn nigga was a blues singer in Chicago. What's his name? Thomas A. Dorff, the blues singer in Chicago. He got, he got rich off the blues and lost his money in the damn depression. And when he lost his money in the depression, and he was broke, he turned it around and he filtered in the blues by adding the doggone lyrics to old spiritual songs, old gospel songs of Europeans. The shit is rooted in the blues. Some of I don't own a blues album in my damn house. You sing the fucking blues when you're in that shit. You know what I'm saying? Your woman leave you in the blues, you feel like a wretch. Well, when you sing uh, a wretch like me in the fucking gospel, what's the difference? A wretch is a wretch. You see? So the key here is we are in two, we going in 2002 and you got to relinquish that that don't work. White people don't fuck around with shit that don't work. That's why they're better than you. You'll fuck around for a hundred years on some bullshit that don't work. White people, if it don't work, they be like, wait a minute, this shit ain't working, goddammit. I gotta throw this bullshit here away, cause it ain't working. We the only damn people, shit don't work. I still got to vote. And the shit don't work. You see what I'm saying? So, my point here is, look, nobody don't wanna, don't wanna hear no shit about no praying, or none of that, all that bullshit about Jesus was good to me because your child is 14 million in prison based on Time Magazine or Newsweek Magazine. Damn. And I don't give a damn what you say. Them some fucked up odds when we got massive amount of black people, black men died in the 1990s. You know what I'm saying? Just, just literally. Just a damn killing field right here in America with our own people and we still running that bullshit. <laughs>